and I'm back on the road. Good morning from the world's largest pistachio. Let's get a better look at this big old nut, huh? Yeah, that's a pretty big pistachio. I am in Tucson, Arizona. I did a major stretch of the drive. I've basically been driving since 4 a.m. It's noon now. It is 90 something degrees and sunny. I'm loving it so much, especially now that I'm not driving. Don't worry, I did stop for a sandwich and a nice big cold bottle of water. I just got to 22nd Street Antique Mall. Now, I've been worried that I'm never gonna make it to California, right? And I have a feeling I'm gonna stay in Arizona much longer than anticipated because the antique malls here look awesome and plentiful. So. Let's hit our first stop. Oh my gosh, that bracelet. And of course I like the two things in the case that aren't 50% off. And that little happy Easter flower. I mean, the bunny and the chick are cute, but that one with the happy flower is everything. But that's at 25, even with the, uh, with the 50% off. Oh my gosh. Look at the artisan Rakonda whale. Oh my gosh, he's amazing. And so is the hippo. Okay, this is gonna be just as awesome as I thought. Now, I have only been to Arizona once and I was in Phoenix and I do remember that a lot of the prices were a little bit higher than I was accustomed to, but I remember there was still some good stuff to be found. And I'm having the feeling that this is gonna be the same here. Look at this, as is. What's as is about it? It's plastic. Am I missing something? I mean, it's got a little bit of discoloration. I've never even seen this. Oh my gosh, and how much fun is this tray? Oh, that is fun. Oh man, I'm really into this. And the Madonna planter. Now, it's $8? What? Oh man, I have to get that. Whoa, 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 whoa. That is so cool. I've never seen one quite like that before. It's $12, it seems, <sighs> but I've never seen it before. It's really, really interesting. I kind of want to get it anyway, even though it might not be the best deal. Oh my gosh. Look at the big chief opener. That's amazing. Ugh, I don't even know what to do with myself right now. The Fenton box is 24. What? The Lucite Paintpoint, $8? Um, I need to put this stuff down because I'm a bit overwhelmed. I'm gonna leave this here and I'm gonna come back to this booth. I know I always say that when I'm in PA and don't mean it, but I actually mean it this time because I'm really, really overwhelmed. This jewelry box is $12. Dude, this, this is like, I just need to at least get more than one booth in. <laughs> before I just start tearing through. So, <laughs> I've only made it one more booth and it seems insanely reasonable here. Like this is $15. That's so pretty. Like all this. All right, so the swung glass is a little bit more expensive as it should be because that stuff's going crazy right now. I'm going crazy right now. Ah, uh, this place is huge. I am thinking I'm gonna wanna go out and get my sweater. Oh, <gasps> Miss Priz, 160. Yeah, I'm thinking I'm gonna wanna go out and get my sweatshirt because it looks like I'm gonna be in here for a very long time. So that's what I'm gonna do. All right, I got my sweatshirt as hot as it is. They definitely believe in air conditioning here. Oh, let's see, oh, that's not what I thought it was. I'm just grabbing stuff randomly. <laughs> I'm really into like everything happening here. Look at this mirror. That's kind of neat. 15. And these are really neat. $8. I like this planter too. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Let's get into it. I'm really excited that this is only my first stop. I think I'm gonna stay here for an extra day. Wow, that is gorgeous. 
wait, 32 and 30% off? Is that for real? That seems really inexpensive. That is really pretty. Let me do the math on that. Yeah. I, I need to find baskets. That's what's the problem. That's why I'm not picking up stuff because I don't see any baskets anywhere. I would probably have a basket full already if it wasn't for it. Um, the fact that I don't have a basket. Like, what? Cat plaque. <laughs> um, ooh, boots, boot planters. Yeah, I need to find a basket. That's what needs to happen. I'm never going to make it through this place. I've gone back to the entrance twice already. <laughs> so they don't have baskets, unfortunately. I did go ahead and get the little lucite paperweight. Wow, there's a lot of really neat stuff in here. Oh my gosh, look at the hair combs. Oh. Let's see, what's the price on that lacquered brooch? This is funny too. It's got a little damage. All right, I'm going for that creamer and sugar set. Um, I can't stop thinking about it. I haven't forgotten about the Madonna nor the bear, but this is like a now situation. Well, I know this is new, but it's half off and it's hilarious. For six bucks, is that what it does? Yeah, 12 and 50% off. I'm gonna take that because it's really amazing. How cute. Those are adorable. That might be fun as like a buy it now. Oh, these are so cute. I think I'm gonna get two of these just because they're so cute. I think they might be uh, good for like maybe doll collect. I don't know, maybe they're too new. Ah. I am overwhelmed. Let me stop. I'm going to leave these for now and come back to that. I got got the paperweight, the cat bowl, and oh my gosh, what is this? The cat bowl blondie. Oh, puzzles really don't sell well for me though. And the sugar and creamer. Let's see if I can make it through <laughs> at least an aisle. Little glass fish. $5? What? 20% off, so four. All right, <laughs> well, we'll take this. Hmm. Yeah, those are newer. All right, 50% off. Oh my gosh, this chalkware. Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff in here. I'm so nervous. 150, 75, that's totally fair. Let me not knock into anything. There's a lot going on in here. That's amazing. Oh, wow. This is really overwhelming. All right, let me start from the beginning of this booth. I got totally sidetracked by that, as I'm sure you can see why. Hmm. Look at this funky thing. 32 and 50% off. Interesting. Um... Let's keep going. What's over here? There's a lot, a lot to see here. Well, I'm trying to go in order, but you know, I'm totally fixated on this. Oh my gosh. What? This is fantastic. Okay, let's, this is amazing. Um. 15% off. So let's call it like $27. I've never seen one anywhere remotely like that. I'm gonna get this. Let me make sure it's not broken because it kind of seems too good to be true. I know I normally go for the Japan ones, but I mean, can you blame me? And then of course I noticed this Mexican folk art rooster he's fantastic but um at that price i definitely can't do anything with it look at the cat bottle that's kind of fantastic for 15 dollars and 15 percent it's really heavy uh i'm not 
I'm not like crazed by it with all the stuff I'm finding. It needs a little extra something. Let's see. What about the wall plaques? Is it 15 for the pair? It's not bad at all. Oh my gosh, I'm so overwhelmed. All right, so it's not 15 for the pair, it's 15 each. So I feel good about leaving those behind. Everywhere I look, there's something. And I have my hands full, which isn't helpful. And mid-century panther, $80. Ooh. Okay, so not everything here is insanely reasonable priced as to be expected. 20% off, all right. Well, that doesn't help me much. Moving on. Look at this weird little mug. That's different. I've seen, um, I've seen the Frank, I think it's Frank Coma. I could be wrong actually, because it's not marked, but I've seen that style before. No, it's probably Japan actually, now that I'm thinking about it. Japan makes a same, uh, similar version as the Frank Coma mugs. I've never seen whatever that animal is. I think this is 10, yeah. Checkers. Oh my gosh, how cute. $9, I kinda wanna see if it's complete. It doesn't really look complete, does it? Maybe it is. That's really neat. Um, let me get down here so I can put some of this stuff down. So it does kind of appear to be missing one piece and they just put this random one in to replace it. I think I'm gonna go ahead and leave that behind. It's very cute, but I feel like that would have to be in pristine condition for me to be successful with it. Oh my gosh. Look at this lamp. That's amazing. Yeah, that's cast metal. That's amazing. Really good price, but not for me today. Although, I feel like I could even make money off that, but I don't want to spend $60 on it. These cranberry candy jars are very pretty. Those are at 12. I'm looking for a discount sign just in case I'm missing it. Oh my gosh, look at this. That's really pretty. Eight dollars. It's kind of different. I kind of like that it has some more to it, but I think I'm gonna leave it behind too. I don't want to get too too carried away. I still have the space problem in my car. Oh my gosh! Look at that Mexican pottery piece. And what about this flamenco dancer? She's fantastic, but at fifteen, there's not enough room for me to get excited about spending fifteen dollars on that. Um, I'm in a very strange mood, seeing as how I've been driving into the sun and doing a time difference <laughs> for like seven hours. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna watch this back and be like, what am I doing? Look at this little Italian mirror. Italy, what does it say? 12, that's really fair. And then this, wood box is really nice i don't usually go for stuff like that that glass um jewelry box is amazing this looks like italy too yes and it's only six dollars i'm gonna get that i think that's really sweet oh it's not focusing there it is yeah i think that's kind of sweet i thought they said there would be people walking around to help me <laughs> i'm kind of I'm kind of not, I, I understand why they do it because I've seen people really misuse the basket situation, but this is really kind of obnoxious. This is amazing. Even though it's on the newer side, 1985, $12, do I see a discount? Because I don't think I can get too much more out of that, no. All right, I might have to go back to the front once again and drop more stuff off because I don't think they understood when I said I'm gonna have full hands the entire time I'm here. Oh my gosh, I didn't even make it to the next booth. Speaking of full hands, whoa. Okay, let me take a step back. I'm actually about to drop this fish, which is why I wanted a basket. Um, let me stop being like that. Oh my gosh, $3 for these little wood mushrooms. I think they're newer, but still. Little frog, $4. This is obnoxious. All right, well, I'm gonna take the frog and I'm about to drop stuff, so I need to go to the front immediately. Oh my gosh, and of course now I just see this t-shirt. How fun. 
All right, so I'm going to go and continue as I was going booth by booth. I'm not going to booth hop as badly as I want to right now. What is that? Pixie. What is the price? 30 I think that says $30. That stinks because that thing's incredible. Oh, my gosh. How did I even miss the mermaid? 21 Brazil. <sighs> I don't think there's enough room in that for me. I could definitely make some money off of it, but it's just a matter of how much I'm going to spend here. So far I'm at $90 and I've left a lot of stuff on the shelves that I really wanna get. I'm gonna do two sweeps probably here, but I'd like to make it to this booth first. All right, this is amazing. Oh my gosh, the elephant compact. How cute. Oh, I should probably show what I'm talking about instead of just waving my phone around, right? <gasps> Hold Howard and look at the cat teabag holder. Ask the front desk for a key. I think I will. Um, yeah, I want to see how much the cat teabag holder is. That's really cute. And the Hold Howard are at 29. Um, I could make money off of that, but... They're definitely a little bit on the more common side. These are 29 for the pair. This is really overwhelming. This rooster? What? He's only $9? Oh, it's been so long since I had one of these. I kind of want to get this. And what's this cute little thing? Interesting. Poodle? Six? missing a little paint still for six dollars what about this bird the pigeon is at 13 and i like the ashtray yeah there's a lot to like here oh my gosh i'm really overwhelmed i think i'm just gonna have to do two scans i'm gonna get what i can now and come back again around because I'm fried, especially after driving seven hours. Oh my gosh, I love this little Dutch boy. I've never had much luck with the Dutch motif. Okay, also I just remembered Lisa Frank is from here. 120. Whoa, look at this desk caddy. How interesting, $39. Hmm. There's a lot of different stuff than I normally see here, which is definitely adding to my feeling of being overwhelmed, but it's very refreshing. I'm sure tomorrow when I wake up and go out, I'm gonna be really, really pumped up. What is the graphic on this ashtray? Hula hands. Hmm. Raffles. That's kind of interesting. Hmm, and then the tray back here. It's like a small, ooh, that's in rough shape, actually. Take my poodle back. Oh my gosh. And look at all the religious items. Oh, <gasps> dude. Hold up. All right, I need to put my belongings, well, my purchases down. This, oh my gosh, wait, stop everything here. Oh, wow, oh wow. All right, well, first of all, I have to look at this for my own purposes. That is insanely cool. Wow. I don't think, uh, I don't think I can justify hauling that home. <laughs> I really wish I could. Wow. What? Dude. $65? Only 30 and 50% off?